The countdown has started. Right now, an asteroid named 2025 FA-22 is closing the distance to Earth at over 25,000 miles per hour. On September 18th, it will make one of the closest passes for an object of its size that we've seen in years. Breaking news, there is a big asteroid about to perform a very close flyby to the Earth in just a few days on September 18th of this year, 2025. It's a 550-foot monster, a true giant. Many people are rightly concerned about this single space rock. But the real story is that this asteroid isn't alone. It's the scout for a whole fleet of cosmic debris, an asteroid wave that could change everything. And the thing that sent them our way? It's a mysterious visitor from another star system, an object that already broke all the rules and fired a pulse that was anything but natural. 3. I Atlas the day the sky falls. On September 18th, 2025, humanity will get a stark reminder of our place in the universe. A place on a beautiful blue marble, drifting through a cosmic shooting gallery. On that day, an asteroid designated 2025 FA-22 will make an uncomfortably close approach to Earth. Now, when astronomers say close, they're usually talking about millions of miles, but not this time. This is different. This asteroid will pass within just 2.2 lunar distances. That's just over 500,000 miles away. While that might sound like a lot, in the vastness of space, that's like a bullet whizzing past your ear. You see, the thing nobody tells you is that an object of this size, traveling at these speeds, doesn't need to hit us to cause problems. Its gravitational pull alone can have subtle effects, a cosmic calling card left behind. Let's talk about size, because that's where the wow factor really kicks in. 2025 FA-22 is estimated to be around 170 meters in diameter. That's about 550 feet. Picture the Statue of Liberty, from the base to the tip of her torch. Now picture that entire structure, made of solid rock and metal, tumbling through space at over 25,000 miles per hour. It's 16 times faster than a rifle bullet. An object that big has enough kinetic energy to be a real planet-altering event. To give you some perspective, the asteroid that created the famous Behringer Crater in Arizona was only about 160 feet across. This thing is more than three times bigger. The most famous modern comparison is the Tunguska event of 1908. On that day, something exploded in the sky over a remote part of Siberia. It flattened over 800 square miles of forest, an area bigger than the entire city of Houston, Texas. The shockwave was felt hundreds of miles away, and scientists believe the object that caused it was likely smaller than 2025 FA-22, probably around 160 to 190 feet. It exploded in the atmosphere, so it never even hit the ground. Now imagine an object significantly larger, the destructive potential is, to put it mildly, staggering. It's the kind of event that doesn't just make headlines, it redraws maps. What many overlooked is that we've only been seriously tracking these near-Earth objects for a few decades. We're cosmic toddlers, just learning to spot the dangers in our own backyard. Here's a crazy insight some scientists are whispering about. The trajectory of 2025 FA-22 lines up with the projected debris field of a recent, very strange visitor. That visitor was 3I Atlas, the interstellar object that fired a mysterious pulse and defied all known physics. The theory is that we aren't just seeing a random asteroid. We might be seeing the first piece of shrapnel from Atlas's bizarre flyby. This flyby isn't just a celestial event, it's a fire alarm. It's a warning shot across the bow of spaceship Earth. But this asteroid is just the beginning of the story, not just one rock. Many people are crazy about the September 18th event, and for good reason. It's a single, tangible threat that's easy to focus on. But not all things are what they seem. What if 2025 FA-22 isn't a lone traveler? What if it's just the first drop of rain in a coming storm? Astronomers and sky watchers have noticed something unusual happening. There's been an uptick, a noticeable increase in the number of objects passing through our neighborhood. 
it's not just 2025 FA-22. Around September 16th and 18th, other smaller asteroids are also making close passes. It's like our planet is suddenly the most popular spot in the solar system. This cluster of activity is what's being called the asteroid wave. It suggests that something has disturbed the cosmic dust, nudging these ancient rocks from their stable orbits and sending them hurtling toward the inner solar system. Think of the solar system as a giant, mostly empty space. For billions of years, planets and asteroids have followed their set paths like cosmic clockwork. But what if something big, something with a lot of gravity, passed through the outer solar system? It could act like a giant bowling ball scattering the pins. That is the leading theory, and the prime suspect is 3I Atlas. This was no ordinary comet. It came from another star, traveled for millions of years, and when it got here, it behaved erratically, even firing what appeared to be a nuclear pulse. That gravitational disturbance theory is gaining ground. Scientists believe that as Atlas sped through the outer solar system, its immense gravity and mysterious energy output sent a ripple through the Oort cloud, dislodging comets and asteroids and sending them on new, unpredictable paths toward the Sun and toward us. One of the most curious pieces of this puzzle is a brand new comet named Swan 25b. Comets are usually predictable, but Swan 25b was different. It seemingly burst into existence from behind the sun, already bright and active. It's brightening at a rapid pace, far faster than expected, suggesting it's a very fresh comet on its first ever trip this close to the sun. Early predictions show it making a close approach to Earth in October, just a few weeks after the asteroid flyby. Coincidence? Not if 3i Atlas is the culprit that knocked it loose. This isn't a random collection of events. It's a connected series, a trail of breadcrumbs leading back to that mysterious interstellar visitor. We're seeing the downstream effects of a major cosmic event, and its consequences are only just now arriving at our doorstep. A visitor from the void. This is where the story takes a turn into the truly unknown. For all of human history, every object we've ever seen in our sky has belonged to our solar system. They were all born from the same cloud of gas and dust as our sun. But recently, we've started to spot intruders, visitors from other star systems. The first was Oumuamua in 2017. The second was Borisov in 2019. And now there is a third. Three, I Atlas. The I stands for interstellar, and it is a complete and utter mystery. What many overlooked is its bizarre trajectory. It's not orbiting the sun like a planet or an asteroid. It's just passing through, a tourist on a journey that began in a solar system we may never see. 3i Atlas is behaving in a way that has scientists scratching their heads. It seems to be an ancient Manx comet, a rocky comet with very little tail. But the thing nobody tells you is just how strange its path is. It came into our solar system from a strange angle, moving at an incredible speed. It's a messenger from an unknown place, carrying with it the chemical and physical secrets of another star. Could the gravitational pull of an object like this, a true heavyweight from interstellar space, be the very thing that disturbed the Oort cloud? Could 3i Atlas be the cause of the asteroid wave? It's a speculative idea, but one that fits the evidence surprisingly well. Its path through the outer solar system could have been the cosmic nudge that sent 2025 FA-22 and Comet Swan 25b on their current collision courses with Earth's orbit. Many people are crazy about the idea of alien life, but the arrival of interstellar objects like 3i Atlas is, in a very real way, a form of first contact. Not with a spaceship, but with a piece of another solar system. It's a sample of a different corner of the galaxy, delivered right to our front door. Studying these objects is like cosmic archaeology. We can analyze the light reflecting off their surfaces to understand what they're made of. Is it rock? Metal? Ice? Does it contain organic molecules, the building blocks of life? These are the questions that could be answered. The presence of 3i Atlas at the same time as this asteroid wave is, to put it mildly, a huge coincidence. It forces us to wonder, is this all a random cosmic alignment? Or are we missing a key detail about how the galaxy works? Is our solar system more connected to our stellar neighbors 
than we ever dared to believe. The question is, what does this all mean for us right now? What happens next? So, let's bring this all back down to Earth. You've heard about the big asteroid on September 18th. You've heard about the strange new comet and the interstellar visitor. Many of you are probably wondering, should we be panicking? Is this the end of the world? The truth is no. Asteroid 2025 FA22 is going to miss. The models are very clear on that. We are safe from this particular rock, but that's not the point. The thing is, this whole series of events, the asteroid wave, is a wake-up call. It's the universe knocking on our door to remind us that we live in a dynamic and sometimes dangerous neighborhood. Are we just lucky that 2025 FA22 is a miss and not a hit? Absolutely. To put it mildly, this is cosmic luck on a planetary scale. What if the gravitational nudge that sent it our way had been just a little bit stronger? What if its orbit was just a fraction of a degree different? We have programs to detect these objects, like NASA's Planetary Defense Coordination Office. They use a network of powerful telescopes, like the PanStars in Hawaii, to scan the skies every single night. They are our sentinels, our watchers on the wall. But here's the secret they can't hide. They can't see everything. Many of these objects are made of dark, non-reflective rock, making them almost invisible against the black of space. They are cosmic needles in a galactic haystack. And they can come from any direction, including from the direction of the sun, which is a huge blind spot for our ground-based telescopes. The fact that we are seeing this wave of activity, including an object from another star, tells us that the solar system is not the predictable clockwork machine we once thought it was. It's wild, it's chaotic, and we are just beginning to understand the rules. For every one of the roughly 30,000 near-Earth asteroids we have found, scientists estimate there are thousands more of this size still lurking out there, completely undiscovered. The people watching this are looking for answers, maybe even a bit of mystery. And the biggest mystery is this. Are we ready for the day our luck runs out? This isn't about fear. It's about understanding the stakes. An object the size of 2025 FA-22 hitting the Earth would release more energy than every nuclear weapon on the planet detonating at once. It wouldn't be a planet-ending event, but it would be a civilization-altering one, capable of creating a crater 10 miles wide and changing the climate for years. That is why this flyby is so important. It's a fantastic opportunity. It's a fire drill for our planet. During the close approach, every available instrument will be pointed at it. Giant radio telescopes like the Goldstone Observatory in California will bounce radar signals off its surface. This will give us an incredibly detailed 3D map of the asteroid, its exact size, its shape, how fast it's spinning, and whether it has any moons of its own. We will analyze the sunlight reflecting off of it to figure out what it's made of. Is it solid metal, a pile of rubble, or something else entirely? This event is a scientific goldmine, and the asteroid wave, along with the arrival of 3i Atlas, is not a prophecy of doom. It is a revelation. It reveals that we are part of a much larger, much more interconnected cosmos than we ever knew. We are not alone, not because of little green men, but because the very rocks and dust from other stars are now visiting us. So what are we going to do about it? For the first time in history, we are starting to have an answer. NASA's recent DART mission, which successfully changed an asteroid's orbit by crashing a spacecraft into it, was our first step. It was humanity's first attempt to fight back against the cosmos. But it's just one small step, the universe has given us a warning. The question is, are we listening? We've explored the coming flyby, the mysterious asteroid wave, and the visitor from another star. What do you think is causing this sudden cosmic traffic jam? Is it a coincidence or a sign of something bigger? Let us know in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more deep dives into the mysteries of our universe. Is it only a matter of time before a major impact happens?